Hello Pineapple Mamas! Many of you have been asking me how I've been liking my new 4 Moms Mamaroo Sleep Bassinet in comparison to my Halo Swivel Sleeper Premier Bassinest. So I'm going to do a comparison video for you so that you can choose which one is best for your baby. I'm Ashley Nicole and my channel is all about helping moms with infertility issues and through pregnancy as well as parenting advice. So today we're going to be talking about the 4 Moms Mamaru Sleep Bassinet and the Halo Swivel Sleeper Premier as well as the Lux. Okay, first off let's start with price. The 4 Moms Bassinet retails at $349 US dollars and 99 cents and the Halo Premier Bassinet retails at $289 dollars and 99 cents. It also has a luxe version, $349.99, comparable to the Four Moms Bassinet. So today we're gonna focus on all three. I do have an older version of the Halo Bassinet. However, the upgrades that they have are more so on color and then two vibration modes. Obviously, I do have the latest version of the Four Moms Bassinet. However, mine does have a vibrate feature that has since been taken off. So let's move on into ease of assembly. The Four Moms Bassinet does not require any tools to put together. It only has four legs that can be extended for height. And the bassinet portion also just requires two prongs to be lifted up in order for it to extend. For all the Halo bassinets, it does require a Phillips screwdriver in order to assemble the bottom of the base. And the top of the bassinet also does come in separate parts so that you have to put those together as well. So I would definitely say that the Halo takes a little bit more time to put together, whereas the Four Moms bassinet is put together in a jiffy. One thing I can definitely agree on is that both bassinets are beautiful. They both have neutral colors. The Four Moms comes in one neutral color and then the Halo does have several different colors that it comes in, but in the more neutral family. So I really like when they blend into the room and they don't stick out. They both come with breathable mesh, which is of course a safety standard. The Four Moms has two layers of breathable mesh. The prongs sit on the inside and are extremely thin, so there would be no disruption in the baby's breathing because it's a very small portion that's covered. Now the Halo Bassinet also has breathable mesh all around. However, the Premier version has two side pockets for storage that do have an obstructed part that does not have breathable mesh. The Lux version only has one little obstruction part and the rest of it is mesh so I would say the luxe version is a lot better so that way the baby doesn't have any disruption in their breathing however they are very strategically placed at the ends of the bassinet where the head and feet go or at the midsection of the bassinet where the middle of the body goes so I wouldn't say I'd worry too much about that and as I mentioned, the Halo does have storage. It has two side pockets for you to be able to store anything to have it readily accessible. The Four Moms does not have storage included. You can add storage to the bottom of the bassinet at the base for $14.99 on their website, but it is an additional feature. So I would have to say the Halo having storage for all their bassinets is pretty convenient. If you find this video informative, make sure and hit that like button so I can do some more comparison videos. Now moving on to ease of clean. The Four Moms does not come apart, so you cannot wash the mesh. You can, however, spot clean it. And of course, you can clean the mattress sheet. Now, the Halo lining does come apart if you completely disassemble it, which we have done and is difficult to do for most of their bassinets. But the Lux version that is comparable to the Four Moms price does have a zipper so that you can take it off and wash it. So that is pretty convenient. This isn't a deal breaker for me because I don't think they get that dirty anyway. And in reality, I just need the sheets to be clean. Everything else, spot cleaning is perfectly fine. All right, let's dive a little deeper. So, the Four Moms and the Halo both have very different features. First off, the Four Moms has movement. So you're going to get five different motions with five different speeds. They have everything from car ride to kangaroo. So obviously this is a great plus. It really helps the baby stay asleep when the bassinet is still moving. I won't go into details on all that. If you do want a more detailed review, I'm gonna go ahead and link my first impressions as well as my updated review for the Four Moms bassinet up here. The Halo does not move, however, it does swivel, and this really does help with co-sleeping. You can get it a lot closer to your bedside. It does also have 
one other part that moves, which is going to be the collapsible sidewall. This is especially great for breastfeeding moms and for C-section moms. I myself didn't use it that much, but I definitely think it's beneficial and it really does make an ease of getting the baby in and out of the bassinet. Also the new Lux version of the Halo, the top can be removed and put into another room so that you don't have to take your baby out. Now, when it comes to sound, both bassinets do have sound. The Four Moms has four different noise options. It has white noise, rain, ocean, and shh. And obviously the volume can be adjusted. The Halo has three natural womb sounds also with volume adjustment. It also has two vibrate features. They have since taken off the vibrate feature on the Four Moms. It does naturally have a vibrate with the motion itself. So I think that is great. I personally didn't like the vibrate that it came with because it was very aggressive so I think that's why the manufacturer decided to take it out. Both the sound and the noise are on timers. The Halo has a 30 minute timer so that your baby can fall asleep. The Four Moms does have Bluetooth capability and has the ability to adjust the timer. So you can go anywhere from 30 minutes all the way up to four hours where it does shut off. And the Halo also has a 30 minute nursing timer. This is meant so that if you start nursing, it gives you an alert so that you don't fall asleep and you put the baby back in the bassinet. The size of the four moms is a little bit smaller and it definitely fits a little bit better in the room. The halo is larger and does take up more room, but is meant to swivel around and be next to your bed. The Four Moms is not meant to be next to the bedside, more so I'd say about a feet or two away so that it can properly move. It does, however, move within its own base so you don't have to have much more room than its base. Let me include the dimensions here and here. So as you can tell, the Mamaru has a 25 pound limit and then the Halo has a 20 pound limit. The Four Moms also weighs less at 30 pounds and the Halo weighs 37. So as you can tell, they are pretty different bassinets. They both serve different needs. I would say the Mamaru is more meant for a baby who needs constant movement. And also it really is nice to have that Bluetooth feature so you don't have to get up every single time it turns off. You can just keep resetting it from your phone and you can change the sound and the volume from the ease of your bed. So I really love the convenience of the Mamaru. When it comes to the Halo, this is more meant for co-sleeping so that you can have the bassinet right next to your bedside and it has the collapsible side. So it's really great for moms that are breastfeeding or have C-sections. It does not have movement, but the vibration modes that do last 30 minutes are pretty nice. For me personally, that we have tried both with my daughter, I would say that the four moms is better by a landslide just because of the motion. I didn't use the collapsible portion for the halo, so I wouldn't say that that was a winner for me. I really love the movement to the four moms because my baby really needs constant movement. So that's a winner for me because it specifically is better for my daughter. I hope this helped you make a decision between the four moms bassinet or the halo bassinet. For more videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you're always informed on when I upload videos. Thanks again for watching and remember mamas, stay hopeful and stay happy.